Okay, the worker said you should stab it like you're stabbing a person. Oh, that's that's fun. <laughs> All right. Hi, I'm Yulia, and I'd like to order a mango green tea with lychee jellies. And my name is Annika, and I'll just take a milk tea with pearls. As we know, Ann Arbor is totally run by bubble tea. So we're taking today to try all of them and figure out which one's the best. We have Sweeting, Cha Time, Cocoa, Tea Ninja, Dink Tea, Share Tea, and the Quickly that just opened where Bubble Island used to be. Rest in peace. Rest in peace. Our criteria should be how stressed we get when we order, <laughs> and then bubble, and then tea. <laughs> yeah. Bubbles too firm. It yeah. takes a long time to chew them, which I don't know. I'm not a fan of like sitting and chewing for that long. Also, I feel like they could be a little more syrupy, like a little more flavor. Not a lot, just a little. Mm -hmm. Um, it's like not enough tea flavor without like compromising the like. I can taste the tea. The sweetness. Yeah, it's like you can taste the tea, but it's still like sweet, but not like too sweet. Mm -hmm. I think the system with how they give you the bubble tea. There's a pulley. There's a pulley, and I think that's super fun. Um, yeah, overall, I think very solid option for Ann Arbor bubble tea. Passes the vibe check by far. The bubbles, I think they could be a little more syrupy. I think I think the actual tea flavor of Cha Time is my favorite. Bubbles are perfect. Tea is perfect. It's the prototype. It's just the the staple, the ideal. I think the bubbles are good. Mm -hmm. This tastes like coffee to me. The mango one, I really like. I kept waiting for the mango flavor and I didn't get it. Not not really a fan of their green tea. But I do think the bubbles are good, you know. Classic bubbles. I've been chewing for a really long time. Yeah. Also, it's really sweet. And like, I like, I like my bubble tea is really sweet, but like, it's just very sugary sweet, not like flavor sweet. Vibe check? I don't know. How was Teen Ninja's vibe check? They were nice. I got stressed when I got in there. But that's... Might be a me thing. Mm -hmm. They have different bubbles. Yeah, I went to order and they said that their golden boba was like their tapioca. Um, their mango tea has like a very lemony flavor to it. I feel like it's like when your mom makes tea and she's like, "Oh, I'm gonna put in a bunch of lemon and honey." But like she just puts in like a like crap ton of lemon. That's that's this. Your mom's bubble tea. Yeah, this is your mom's bubble tea. This is your mom's bubble tea. I picked up share tea, and I had the time of my life. The workers <laughs> were so nice, and I wanted to stay there all day. Oh, share tea puts like pulp in their, for lack of a better word, they have pulp in their tea. That's the one thing that I've always noticed is different from other places. While I like appreciate the very fresh aspect, I don't know how much I appreciate like the actual like seeds in there. A bit too organic. <laughs> yeah. yeah, exactly. It's like, yeah, exactly. I think well-intentioned, but then sometimes I'm just like, it's, you know, it's a lot of chewing of not, and I'm already chewing my tapiocas. Okay. Um, this is very sweet. This is very sweet. I would adjust the sweetness. They give you a lot of bubbles, though. They do. Which it's also a really big size. Mm -hmm. This is massive for a regular. Yeah. Also, their sweetness is like, at least for the mango, it's like mango-y sweetness. It's not just like straight sugar sweetness. So I'm like, I'll take it. Okay. This is what I meant by syrupy. <laughs> These, I would say, almost too syrupy, but... I think it's the perfect bubble. I think it's the perfect bubble. Bubble's perfect. Perfect. Um, tea sweet. Yes. Mine kind of tastes like coffee. I like, Mine tastes like coffee! It tastes like coffee, but I'm like, how does a <laughs> green tea- like, I don't know, it doesn't taste like mango. I don't- 
Bubbles perfect. I Tea, want... sweet, coffee notes, question mark. Yeah. Um, the vibe, the vibe was good. I liked it. Um, I think it's a cute place. You know, they... Neutral, honestly. Like they, they... Vibe check neutral. We drank all of our bubble tea. I feel unwell. Yeah. This was, this was a lot. And we will be drinking these for like the next week straight. For forever. Yeah. Um, but I think we're ready to deliberate. Okay. Okay. So what, okay, what, what was your favorite one? Let's say I don't account for you. One, two, three. Chai time. Okay. I can start with mine. Tell me about it. Yes. Okay. Sweeting. Okay. Granted, this is my go-to place because the closest proximity to me. Conflict of interest. Con conflict of interest. That's, you know, my full disclosure. Um, so that might be why it just feels like home to me. The tea flavor just matters so much to me and I think they have the best overall tea flavor where it's not too sweet. You st it still tastes like tea, but it's still like sweet enough where like someone who likes sweeter teas is like satisfied. It's just overall I'm my ideal tea. Cha time makes me feel safe. <laughs> and that's that on that. Yeah. The final remark is that bubble teas are like friends and you're just not going to get along with all of them. And that's okay. I think that's pretty well said, you know, you vibe more with some, you vibe less with others, but that doesn't mean any of them are, you know, bad people, bad peace.